Great goobly gobs of frozen periscope sessions. Have you got an iPad? Have you got the latest iOS, iOS 9? Do you love using Periscope to stream about whatever it is you love to stream about, but all of a sudden it seems like every one of your streams is frozen with video and only people can hear you? Well, in this video, I've got a temporary solution fix for you, so stay tuned. Hi, David Vaughn, The Entrepreneur's Geek here, and as promised, I've got a temporary solution to fix the frozen video screen that your viewers on Periscope are experiencing ever since you've updated your iPhone or iPad to iOS 9 the past few days. All you have to do before you start your next Periscope session, and that's imperative that you do it that way, it's got to be before you start the session. You just need to plug in a headset, like the ones that come with every iDevice out there. Or perhaps you've upgraded and you got something a little bit better. So you can use a headset like this. Or perhaps like me, you like to use a more sophisticated system, maybe a lavalier system. It doesn't matter what you choose. It just matters that you have something with a microphone plugged into the headphone jack of your iPhone or your iPad before you start your next Periscope session. That way, when you flip the camera to the front-facing selfie cam, your viewers will be able to see you and all the Periscope streaming glory that you are and not have to face the frustration of frozen video and audio only. See, to me, I was banging my head against the wall. Why? Because I was thinking it was me, or my internet, or my Wi-Fi, or my iPhone, or my iPad. Oh my gosh, I was so caught up in everything that might have been going on. And so through a little bit of trial and error, I found this solution and I wanted to make sure and share it with you. Now is this a permanent thing you're always going to have to do? I hope not. It should be up to either Apple or Periscope or whatever party is involved with the break to be able to fix it and push out an update. But until that happens, just remember, in order for your viewers to be able to see and hear you when you use your front facing selfie cam, you know, the camera that faces you because that's the way the phone faces, you just need to make sure you use the, either the headset, the ear pods that come with every eye device or whatever headset or microphone system you happen to be comfortable with using. Now for viewers, here's the question. Is there a fix for when I'm watching somebody stream and their video is constantly frozen? Unfortunately for us viewers, no. Why? Because that person who's streaming that Periscope session, they need to apply this fix as well. So what you might want to do is point them to this video and let them know, hey, there's a solution for you as well and we can all have happy Periscope streams. So, how does that work out for you? Give it a test. Like this video, and make sure to share it with everybody you know that is using Periscope to stream the next live whatever it is that they stream. My name's David Vaughn. Thanks a lot for tuning in, and I'll see you on the next one.